While many are familiar with Tesla's 40,000 superchargers worldwide, a less known part about Tesla's public charging network are the 35,000 destination chargers that exist alongside Tesla's superchargers. Singapore now has three Tesla destination charging locations in Changi Point Mall, Four Leaves by Sheraton, and here at Great World. These destination chargers at Great World are right next to the Tesla superchargers behind me. A fourth one is expected to open soon at Resorts World Sentosa. In this video, I'll share an overview about Tesla destination chargers and why I believe we should expect to start seeing a lot more of these in Singapore in the next 12 months. Click subscribe to stay updated to more videos on Tesla. Tesla destination chargers are wall connectors. The same one you can install in your homes. And these provide AC charging for up to 100 kilometers of range per hour at 11 kilowatts. Tesla owners normally don't have to pay for these in many markets. The charging itself is free and all you need to pay for is the parking. Now this pricing strategy is subject to change at any time. I believe that Tesla should introduce idle fees to minimize the risk of charger hogging. Tesla normally works with offices, malls and hotels to install this and become destination charging partners. These businesses do it because it helps them with their sustainability commitments and they know destination charges will attract more crowds to their locations. What does this mean for Tesla owners? For now, destination charges are exclusive to Tesla owners and it's an added perk for owning a Tesla in Singapore. Tesla is actively hiring for charging development and I believe we'll start seeing more destination charges across Singapore in the next 12 months. Looking ahead, Tesla is opening up its charging network to non-Tesla EVs in Europe, US and Australia. I believe it's a matter of when and not if that Tesla will open up at least part of its charging network, both superchargers and destination chargers to non-Tesla EVs in Singapore. This will help Tesla's mission of accelerating the world's transition to sustainable energy and allow Tesla to tap into government EV charging incentives here in Singapore to expand its charging network. Singapore's EV adoption is now at 15%, the highest in Asia Pacific outside of Greater China. Tesla's charging network has a long-term track record for the highest reliability and best usage experience in the world. Where do you think Tesla should open its next destination charges? Would you be concerned if Tesla opened up its charging network to non-Tesla EVs in Singapore? If you found this video useful, please click the like button. Hit subscribe to stay updated to more videos on Tesla.